You don't feel your way into right actions. You act your way into right feelings. Human beings, we have this intrinsic need for our beliefs and our actions to line up with each other. And if we ever think that they don't, unfortunately, it's much easier to change our beliefs and our actions. And I say unfortunately because many times our actions are based on what feels good and not necessarily what's right. So we reach a point where we're letting our feelings dictate our behavior and then we realize consciously that our that behavior is not lining up with what we believe to be true and we don't like that and so we start making justifications and excuses and doing these mental gymnastics so that we can fool ourselves into thinking that the actions that we're taking are actually okay they're actually good they're actually the right thing and what's best for us I'll give you an example let's say that you decide you want to lose some weight and get in shape and get fit and healthy and so um, you you decide that eating the right foods and exercising regularly is the right thing to do. It's what you should do and you're fully bought in and you're, you're gung-ho, you start the week off, you start your diet and exercise program and you're motivated and you're sticking to it and then you get to the end of the week and it's Friday afternoon and maybe you've had a stressful week at work and you're having some, some wicked cravings for junk food and you're feeling sore from the workouts and you just don't feel like sticking to your program anymore. All you're, all you're thinking all day long is all you want to do is lay down on the couch and watch Netflix and eat Cheetos. But you know that that's not what you're supposed to do. You know that that behavior does not line up with your beliefs. So, But you really want to do it because you know it's going to feel good. And so what you do is you start telling yourself these stories. Well, you know what? I've had such a rough week at work. I, I deserve to give myself a break. You know what? I've been doing good, sticking to my diet all week long. I deserve to treat myself. You know what? I'm sore from all these workouts, so I probably should take a little break. You know what? It, it, I probably get hurt if I keep working out, if I keep pushing it too hard. It's probably best for me to take a little bit of break. So if I just lay down on the couch and eat Cheetos and watch Netflix tonight and don't do anything, that's actually what's best for me right now. And we just, we trick ourselves. But that, but doing that, just letting our feelings dictate our behavior just leads to immaturity. It leads to detrimental behavior that makes us unhealthier in, in all ways, spiritually, relationally, physically, financially. You can't let your feelings dictate your behavior. So how do you overcome it? Well, it takes intentionality. It takes purposeful living. You have to make the decision that I know what I'm supposed to do and I'm going to do it. Because when you can do that and you can be consistent with it, the, the correct beliefs will follow. John Maxwell tells this story about a guy who came to him for advice. And the guy said, John, I, I'm not sure what to do. I just, I don't feel like I love my wife anymore. I've been married for all these years and just the feeling of love isn't there anymore. I don't know what to do. And John's advice to him was, well, you have to love your wife. And the guy said, no, John, you don't understand. The feeling of love just isn't there anymore. And John said, I'm not talking about love the feeling. I'm talking about love the action. He said, take her out, buy her flowers, call her during the day, give her compliments, do all the things that you were doing when you were chasing her, when you were trying to date her, act in loving ways towards her. And I promise you the feeling of love will come back. It'll be there. He, John was trying to teach him this lesson that when you act in the right ways, the right feelings will follow. You can't let your feelings dictate behavior. You have to decide that you know what you need to do and you're just going to do it. And then the right feelings will follow because you don't feel your way into right actions. You act your way into right feelings.